hurt me. A little birdie flew into my DMs and told me about a guy named Corvix. And usually I don't pay a whole lot of attention to the birdies in my inbox because there are many, like flocks of them. But for some reason I clicked on this link and I'm now reacting to Corvix because I feel that the world should know this guy's voice. He's covering Celine Dion's My Heart Will Go On in the original key. Let's listen. I've not listened, by the way. You're getting the first time here. Saving it for you. As I always do. Lots of you guys wonder, oh, did you? No, I never watched them first. Oh, very interesting. Okay. Okay, so first of all, like I said, I've not watched this video. I heard a snippet, like a TikTok snippet, but I was not expecting this, actually. This is very interesting. His look is very interesting. I would not expect him to sound the way he is looking, but also the tonality of his voice is very interesting to me. It's got an innocence to it that is an extreme dichotomy from his actual look, and I'm loving it, really loving it. Piercing. Are those contacts are those real? Gorgeous mix head there. Okay, real quick pro tip. This is something that no one ever talks about and singers, pro singers do this, including me all the time. When you sing something like, you have come to show you, go. Did you hear it? Does anyone know what I just did? Go on. what I just do? I sang go on, N-G-O-O, -O, not just go on. Let me show you what it sounds like if I don't sing with an N. You have come to show you, go on. It's so not the same, go on. So what I'm doing is I'm taking that N, which is a semi-phonatable consonant, say that three times fast, and I am singing on the pitch. I'm supposed to sing the word go on, and it gives me time as a singer to tune within myself on that N instead of just doing it on the go. It is such a nice cushion to tune pitch as a singer, and it makes it in the center of the pitch when you go to open up on the open mouth vowel after it. Love the breath he's putting in there. Love the tone there. He's got great control over his mix. Really using that. Love the go with that vocal fry there. Beautiful flexibility in his riffs and runs. Oh. Registerical chains, chest to head. Or just gliding through that melodic line. Ooh, interesting little iteration there of the melody. On and on. Mm -hmm. By the way, can we talk about how this is very different visually from the first video that Celine did? I'm gonna get to that in a second. Ooh, cool, cool. Love that dropout. Small little changes that make it yours when you do a cover. Masterfully done. Ugh, that love that scoop cry. His eyes are like bearing into my soul. Yes. Love it. Yes. Great swell, straight tone and vibrato there. Like how he carried that through. 
Wow, now that's a big drop, okay? The whoa, and it's really easy to do that as a girl, like if you're a belter, but for a guy, that's a lot of range. And did you notice what he did with his mouth to get there? Whoa, he really stretched it out, not just wide, but long to get all the way up to that note. I love how fluid and in the center of the pitch that was, that was gorgeous. Well, it's delicious. Interesting. Wow. Yes. Oh, my heart and that was great. My heart will go on and Okay, so it's like he's in the water, right? And Celine's was like on top of this unsinkable ship, but he's like looking down and doing this video as if he's already sunk. Very cool dichotomy there. His face. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Oh my gosh, chill. Oh my gosh, that placement. Oh my goodness, I love you! Yes! yes! Guys, I hate to stop you, but I have to make you appreciate the perfection of that mix. It was the most perfect 50-50 chest-to-head ratio mix I may have ever heard. Oh my dear goodness, you gotta listen to that again. <gasps> Look at his face, listen to the sound. Oh! Hurt me! Wow. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Wow. I just love how in it he is too. Like he's really working. not expecting that. Wow, I have tingles all over. It's like if an angel dressed in goth, then I'm listening to it. Ice eyes. Oh my gosh, what did I just listen to? I was not expecting that towards the end. That was crazy. Guys, Corvix. I mean, go subscribe to him because he deserves it. He only has 165K subscribers. Why? Why is he not like blowing up the world right now? I just, I just. I was so impressed by that, to be honest. Corvix, if you're listening to this, um, I I could match you. I'm in black right now. We could do a collab. Like, I'm totally down. Just like, have your people call my people, you know? If you wanna hear some more of the greatness of Celine, why don't you do yourself a favor and click on this video next?